Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video, I'm going to be doing a video on playing the game Horns. So you guys probably have heard of this game before. It is a pretty popular horse game. And I'm going to be showing you guys pretty much all of my horses in Horns and just playing it and what I usually do daily. So I have a couple folders. I have the mares, the stallions, the magic horses, which I don't really use. And then the older horses and my project horses. So usually I will take and I will take care of these horses first. So the horse that I was given when I started the game is this horse right here, Promise. And I will take care of the horse and then move on to the next horse. So today I'm going to be telling you guys what breed, age, height, and color each horse is. Promise is a horse that has a never-ending like life cycle. So she is 81 and is a female. She's a thoroughbred and a bay, and her height is 15 to hands. So moving on to the next horse, which is Butter. And today Butter is actually going to full. So we're gonna go ahead and take her to the vet. And as you guys can see, I have a bunch of names right here. And what I'll just do is I will just copy and paste the name into what I'm going to name it. And that's pretty much what I'm going to be showing you guys today. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and turn on your notification bell to get notified any time I post a new video. And let's go ahead and get started with today's video. Okay guys, so I will try to go through this as fast as possible because I do have quite a few horses in this game and I don't want to have this video being an hour long. So this is the new horse that Butter Fold. And Butter is a mare, as you guys might know. She, her coat color is Cherry Bay. She is a thoroughbred and is 29 years old and is the height of 16 hands high. So I'm gonna go ahead and take care of her and then we're gonna move on to the next horse. I do train the horses, so her training is completely done and she is at the highest rank she can get. And then the next horse is Thoroughly Mouse. And this horse is a mouse gray, 28 years old, and is 15 three hands, and a thoroughbred. And I'm going to go ahead and cover her today, which is also known as putting her in full in the game of Horrence. So this is Central Ridge, and Central Ridge is a thoroughbred male, Cherry Bay, that is three years old and is 15 two hands high. So he is going to be the stallion for Thoroughly Mouse. And I'm also going to equip the um, Central Ridge today because he is three years old and at the age of three in the game, you can equip the horse when you want after that age. And I'm also going to train him because he still needs trained and then I will move on to the next horse. So you, as you guys can see, my routine is I try to take care of the horses and then I will cover them, let them go in full and pretty much that. But I also have project horses, which I'm going to show you guys. And I really do like doing the project horses because it gives me a chance to train the horse fully and then not put it in full at all and then I usually sell the project horses for ten thousand dollars on here when they are fully trained and they're usually around 10 years old at the time so it will take me a day or two to get them fully trained with aging points which are known down here it, right beside the put to bed symbol so this horse's name is Twinkle and she is 24 years old a female dark bay and is 15 hands high. I'm gonna go ahead and take care of her and then I will show you my project horse to see what you guys think of that. I really like doing project horses in the game, like I said, because it gives you an extra 
um, some extra money in the game, which helps you get better horses. This is Dakota, a 23-year-old mare, 15.1 hands high, and is a dapple gray. So I have a lot of mares, as you guys can see, and not so many stallions because mares are, I think, more... They're better in the game to get you farther in the game. This is Mally, a thoroughbred female, Terry Bay, 22-year-old, 16, two-hand horse. And her training is complete, so she does not need to do that. All right, so I'm going to take care of one more horse, then kind of go through the horses with you just on the main site. And then I'm going to show you guys my project horses and kind of explain that. This is a female roan, Friday, which is 22 years old and 15.1 hands. So let's go ahead and check out the stallions and the project horses. And then also I separate the older horses with the younger horses because I like to keep one horse that the mare does full throughout um, her lifetime and then the other horses I will turn into project horses so these are the project horses as you can see I have quite a few because I keep pretty much every horse that goes in full and then at the end of this it will kind of show you Big Al Apple Alley Cat is for sale right now for $10,000 and this horse I am currently using as my project horse so I do not put her in full, and what I do is I just train, and then once I train, I will take care of her and then use the aging point to put her to bed for that night and then can, can continue training her for the next day, which will be very beneficial. I usually get around 25 aging points a day by how many horses you take care of, the more aging points you get. So if I have around 70 horses, which I will show you guys how many horses I have in a minute. If I have around 70 horses, then I will get around 25 aging points. So I just keep aging her and then I can continue training her. And by around two to three days, I can be finished training her and she will be complete in training and I can sell her for around $10,000. And then there is two types of money in this game or coins whatever you would like to call it there is the equis and then the pathis so the equis is more cheaper i will show you the selling horses in the game as well so that is pretty much the project horses and now for the stallions like i said i don't have very many stallions these are the stallions and then here are the older horses that we didn't get to and then here are the mares so I have around half of the mares in the mare section, half of them in the older horse section. And then I also have an equestrian center. If you guys play this game, go ahead and check out my equestrian center. I try to upgrade it as much as possible. I have 65 stalls. 64 of them are boarding horses. So I do get a lot of money from that. And then you can also go to the horse sales center and auction a horse or buy one from the auction. You can get any of these horses here. And these are all the auction horses. Like there's 10 seconds left for this horse and five bids. And then you can go, go also to the direct sales area right here. And it will kind of just, you can buy these horses whenever you want. Like if I wanted to buy this $5,000 horse right here, I could just easily click buy it right here and I could buy it. And then there are millions of horses on here. As you can see, there's more expensive horses, which this is pretty expensive for in the game for only being a one-year-old banner is extremely expensive. So... There is also a community where you can join with friends and an achievement section where you can go to your daily objectives and learn and get more passes from the daily objectives. And I will be telling you guys how many horses I have. Um, be, but before I do, go ahead and drop down to the comments and try to guess the number. And if you guys get the number right, you did a very good job counting all the horses as fast as possible. You can even go back to the video where I, or the beginning of the video where I showed you guys all of my horses there and count them if you guys really wanted to. But I'm going to tell you guys how many horses I have 
And then, but before I do that, let's go ahead and check out the store they have. So the store is where you can buy grain or pretty much anything from tack, grain, resources, and even bigger things like water troughs or a tractor. And then there is also the black market where you can buy things with your passes, like the aging points. If you want to buy a whole, whole load of aging points, then you can pay 490 passes, which is pretty expensive. As you guys see, I only have three right now. So this is pretty much the game. If you guys play this game, please tell me down below in the comments and then your username and I will try to friend you on here because I do love to make new friends on this game. It is very fun and I definitely have tried many horse games before and this one has definitely been the best. I've been playing this game for about over two years now and I still really, really like it. So let's go ahead and see how many horses I have. Alright guys, so the final result is 134 horses. So I have, most of them are project horses, but if I do take care of all of them pretty much in the same day, it will take me around a half an hour. Like I said though, I really like this game and have been playing it for a super long time. If you guys like this video, please leave a big thumbs up, subscribe, and comment down below if you play this game with your username and I will try to friend you as soon as possible. And please turn on your notification bell to get notified anytime I post a new video. And if you guys have any video ideas, Please tell me in the comments down below because I would love to know and try out your video ideas. As you guys know, I am an animal channel, so let's kind of keep those to animal type videos. And thank you guys so much for watching.